Alright, hey everybody, welcome back, and once again, we are doing a mod review in Fallout New Vegas. Today, we are looking at the FN FAL SA58 by Wanamingo, uploaded by Nick Hago. So, this mod adds the beautiful SA58 mod from Fallout 4 by Wanamingo into Fallout New Vegas. So, this mod adds a handful of versions of the FAL to your game. You have the G Series FN FAL, which I'm holding here, which has the nice wood furniture. The Israeli FN Fal, which is a very old looking Fal, also with wood furniture. The regular FN Fal, which has polymer parts. And the FN Fal Tactical, which has some rails on the front for you. Now there are also a handful of modifications. There are many, many scopes, and to add those to your weapon, you take a Fal that has the ability to wear said scope. And then you combine it at a workbench with that scope to make a new version of the weapon that has the scope attached. So let's take the Barska site, for example, and craft it. And so now we should have the FN Fal Barska, which has the red dot on it right there. This mod alone does not feature custom animations, but instead uses the service rifle animation. But that still works pretty dang well. Excuse my rapid reload perk there. There are also a handful of mods that you can attach traditionally, like an extended magazine, silencer, and laser. And all of which show on the weapon very beautifully. There are also a handful of unique variants of the weapon that can be found throughout the world. The first of which is a Zealot's Regret, which is a modified foul that shoots plasma shot and has an appropriate magazine attachment, which is very, very cool. The Makako Special is a, uh, shall we say, unique looking foul that has a banana instead of a magazine and shoots missiles instead of your traditional bullets. The Makambura is just a painted version of the standard foul. But the paint job looks very, very nice. The operator features a silencer and a very nice scope on there. The SMH My Foul has a very interesting and large scope that goes all the way to the end of your barrel. The final minute has a very, very cool blue pearlescent and features an ACOG scope with quite a bit of zoom. The Free World is an interesting foul that shoots some type of energy damage with its own custom sound. And has really incredible stopping power. The white mink it features a white pearlescent over the entire gun. It makes the whole thing look pretty much chrome. To obtain any of these fouls, the base fouls can be found throughout the level list and on appropriate enemies. And for the unique weapons, they are as follows. A Zealot's Regret is at the Repcom Facility Entrance Hall. SMH My FAL is at the Dino Gift Shop. The Makako Special is in the Boomer Workshop. The white mink is at the Ultralux Kitchen. The Operator is at Helios 1 next to the mainframe. The Free World is inside the Enclave Bunker. The Last Minute is at Bitter Springs inside a police car. And the Macumbura is in Jacobstown in one of the bungalows. Additionally, there are three cheat chests outside of the back of the Good Springs Schoolhouse, which have the weapons, attachments, and all of the uniques inside. However, they do have a very hard lockpick, so you'll either need to get in that or just use the console. And yeah, guys, I think that covers just about everything with this mod. It's a really great port, and the gun just looks beautiful in New Vegas, and fits really well if you're using weapons of the new millennia, or any other modern weapons. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to try the mod yourself, the link will be in the description as always. And if you enjoyed the video, drop a like. It helps the channel out so much, and I really, really appreciate it. If you want to see more mods like this, or mods in Fallout 4, consider subscribing, because I upload almost daily, if not multiple times a day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thank you.